Back to class as usual over at Indiana University, but in a month, grad students vote on whether to continue their spring semester strike into the fall. Tonight, our Rachel Krause talks with students who tell us the school's making progress, but more action is still needed. With the first few days of the fall semester in the books, students at IU are settling into their school routine. That includes grad student workers who spent much of April and May on strike, demanding the administration recognize them as a union as they fought to end mandatory fees and raise stipends that many struggle to live off of. For years and years and years, they told us it would just be impossible to get rid of the mandatory fees. There was no way to do it. And then all of a sudden they did it. Among our union, it really made us feel like these things that we've been demanding, they're very reasonable. They're not impossible. And we know that when the university says that they're impossible, we know that's not true. We know that if they wanted to uh, make it happen, they could. And this time they did. And the administration is making changes. In the spring, IU announced it would raise the minimum stipend amount up to 18000 Now they've upped it again to a $22,000 minimum and are waiving all mandatory fees. That's a major victory for grad student workers like dual PhD candidate and Cavalier chick. But she says more is needed. This raise that we recently received, it was the first raise that many graduate workers received in 10 years, and it was a result of a strike. Without a union, we would have to strike every single time we need a raise. That is disruptive to higher education in, in Indiana. That is unbecoming for, for an, a, a place of employment, and it's, it's unsustainable at all levels. It would be much easier for them to just recognize our union. In one month, grad student workers will come together again and vote to see if they'll extend their strike into the fall. Hopeful this will finally get the administration to the bargaining table. We reduce the union recognition. We see ourselves having a seat at the table. That was the goal of the previous strike, um, and that is still the goal of this coming strike.